Working on the Taurus cart here. Doing a systems check. I got the speed controller, control box pretty much all together and wired up. We got our dash pretty much all together and wired up. Got our front two batteries in. Two rear batteries are sitting here. Because we got the speed controller out. It goes up under the seat here. And I think we got everything connected up, so we're going to do a systems check. As of right now, the batteries are showing 49.7 volts. The ground's to the ground. They're all connected together, and there's the positive. Flip her on. Showing 50.2, 49.1. Looks like we got about a volt difference. Might have to adjust the calibration a bit. And let's try the thumb throttle. We got power there. And we've also got a brake light. It's activated with our hand control. Meters a little closer, 48.1, 48.9. Yeah, flip her off and got no power. Everything's off. We've also got our new batteries in for the Taurus cart. Use four of these 12 volt, 15 amp hour sealed lead acid batteries and we've got this kind of a dense mat stuff that I lined our battery boxes with and also I put some plastic border around our battery boxes to protect our batteries and then our speed controller goes here inside of the backbone Slides right up under the seat. And then we got our speed controller tucked up all the way up under here. Our wire is tucked off to the side. And then our rear battery slides in place with the ground wire. Front battery drops right in nice and snug. And now we got battery number one, battery number two, battery number three. And battery number four hooked up. So now it's time for a systems check. Turn the circuit breaker on. Turn the power on. Meter says our battery pack's at 53. It's fluctuating a bit. Let's hit our thumb throttle. Got our brake lever up here. Yep, brake light's working. And we also have a push button up here. We'll go in the end of the steering wheel handle. That's for our, I can hear it clicking back here. That's the reverse button. So when you hit this button, then hit the thumb throttle. The motor goes in reverse. Then you let go of the button and it works normal. And then when you're all done, flip the switch. It shuts down the motor and the meter. And also pop your breaker off and all power is shut down. Mm -hmm. 